In this video, we are going to see how we can easily add our ChatGPT to our WordPress website. We can uh, embed uh, the ChatGPT in the left or right down so our visitors can uh, speak with ChatGPT or we can add it to a custom page that can be accessed uh, only if someone is a member. So in this video, we're going to see exactly how we can activate ChatGPT directly into our WordPress website. Site. So I have here a uh, test website that I'm going to use and add ChatGPT to it. So maybe you want to add it for your members or for your visitors. This is a plugin that will help us do that. GPT AI Power, it will help us add the chat GPT to our WordPress website easily. So first thing to do is to go to the dashboard and install this plugin. I'm going to plug in add new. I will search for the plugin. And uh, in here, this is the plugin, I will install it and activate it. I will skip this, I don't want these things. And then next thing that we're gonna need to do is to have an API key from OpenAI. This is my OpenAI account, so to be able to add ChatGPT to your WordPress website, you will need to create an API key. OpenAI is giving you the possibility to test this with three uh, dollars. If you go to the upgrade and you have here usage, you will see exactly how many, how much credit you will be granted. Usually it's eighteen dollars, and in here you can see the usage for uh, your account. And the next thing that we need to do is to go and create the keys. So we have here the view API keys and in here let's create a new API key that we are gonna use and add our chat GPT. Okay, this is the place where we add our key. So we click save and uh, in here we have uh, other options that I've also reviewed uh, in the previous video. I will let a link into the description for the video and how this plugin can help you also write articles and generate images. But right now we're just focusing on uh, ChatGPT and how it can be added to our WordPress website. So in here you have the options for this ChatGPT. You, in here you have the options to, to change the, the model and uh, the DaVinci is the most powerful one. I will let it like this and it's the most expensive one. So basically 1,000 tokens, you will pay a couple of cents and 1,000 tokens, it's, it's about uh, 750 words. And in here you have, if you want to check what all of these things are doing, but for this, I will let it as it is right now. I will let this as it is, as the default one. In here you have the options to uh, put an IE name. So I will put this as UPDOSE IE. Okay, here is how the text will appear for you, is how will appear when the AI is thinking. Next thing we have to, to enable the widget. So I want to enable this widget. Here we have the tone that is friendly, professional, sarcastic, mean. I will just for test, I'll put this mean. Act as, you see in here you have different uh, acting types, like a student, mean and student. And in here you have the, the icon. And in here you have the font size, the color of this thing. And in here you have the width and height. And in here, this is the position. You can add this also with a shortcode. We're gonna see that. So if you hit save and we'll refresh this thing. Let me go and refresh this. Okay, this is the website. We see that we have an, things added in here, but it's not looking that great. So I will need to go and uh, do some uh, changes in here. So in here I will just put this with the uh, height. So height 500 and uh, width 300 to look better. So right now if we refresh this, 
we should have a better size in here so what we can do it is to ask him things you see here you have the name of it hello human we can ask him how are you and he will do another test please uh, give some uh, ideas about how to in wordpress as these are some basic things that i'm just asking and here you see that it's giving me some details about the articles okay then give me some article details so this is one way that you can add this the other way that you can add this is with the shortcode for instance let's say you have a uh, membership website i will also show you how we can enable that with a plugin and uh, you want to have let's say an, like a page where you can add this or a post let me create this with a page a new I will call it chat GPT and what you need to do is to put a shortcode in here I will choose the shortcode block for this and I will hit publish and if we are gonna go and check this page we should have in here the chat GPT that uh, it's embedded into this page so we don't need to, to do anything and click it from there so we see here that it's responsive and in here we can ask him things how are you today so you see it's responded other things that you may want to use this is in your wordpress membership website and for instance you will need a membership plugin that you that you need to enable in here i have one i have through members that is one of the most lightweight and the nice plugin for memberships i've written a review about this plugin that i will gonna install in here and uh, we will protect this page so not everyone to have access to this content because this content uh, provided by ChatGPT costs money and uh, maybe you want only the the one that needs it or have this thing enabled to access it so let me add this plugin in here i have downloaded it and let me go and fetch it so the plugin is called true members it's the nice one i made a review that i will link into the description it's very affordable and very fast and it's activating with sure card payment option so right now i have true members in here and to protect this page what i will need to do is to go and uh, ensure member and in here i'll create an access group and i can call it chat gpt and in here i have the options to choose i will choose uh, specific page for this where I place the chat GPT okay I, here I will enable the message And this is just uh, some standard message that you can enable with this and in here you have the button text that you can put and you have the button URL if you have some memberships types in there and, but in here I'll just let it like this so for you to see what is happening okay it doesn't like this let me put in here the button text get membership and in here I will just put a page I don't have any page with membership in here I'll put this sample page with a login so 
right now if we're gonna go and uh, check this page again let me open a new incognito mode we'll see that we'll not have access to this if you don't have access get access then here you can get the membership and uh, log in if you have an account i have did a uh, presentation of this uh, plugin and how you can uh, use it with uh, true members so you can uh, go and check that if you want to have more details of how you can enable this so right now you see that uh, if you are logged in you have access to, to this thing so in this way you can protect the content with true members if you want so not everyone to have access other thing is like uh, we should check and see the usage so you see there that I just uh, did three queries and uh, we shouldn't see a lot of usage basically should be nothing for for this day you see here that it's barely zero for the the three question that i have asked but in function of uh, how many members you have or for which you want to use this uh, you, these things can build up so yeah this is how you add the chat gpt easily to your wordpress i hope you enjoyed the video in this way you can easily activate ChatGPT into your WordPress website. I hope you enjoyed what you have seen. Please uh, don't forget to subscribe and like the video. Have a nice day and see you next time.